What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Rivals of Ixalan draft on Magic Online. We are probably windmill slamming this fat idiot. And just... Why does he got to be fat idiot? Uh, he doesn't have to be. He just is. Oh. So, there you go. Ah, uh, yeah, this dude is... Whew, that's a spicy meatball. He brings the law. Somebody touch my spaghetti. <laughs> I can't. I can't even say it. Oh god. Somebody touch my spaghetti. So yeah, we're gonna take that dude. Nobody and touches that guy's spaghetti. That's that's the end of that. I hope we can have the same luck our opponent had when they played it against us. That's all I want. Which is all of the luck. The best feeling in the world is when your opponent attack oh look we can now we can get just all the Sphinx cards. We that can card sucks. we can draft the Azor theme deck. Yeah, Chupacabra. That's that's actually what's going to happen. We're going to play this and our opponent's going to be like, Yeah, Chupacabra. Got him. I like Hornswoggle. I also I like, like Water. water. Better. Do you like Water Not Better? Yeah. This lets us ramp out our Azor, though. Think about that. That's greedy. Really? Yeah. I also don't hate this guy. 2-1 that when he dies, make a 1-1. One -one. Yeah, but he's common. <laughs> oh, so is Water Not. I didn't know it was common. Yeah, Water Not's common. Yeah, it's it's rough because sometimes you just run into those chupacabras in the dark alleys. Also, I don't hate Dead Eye Rig Hauler either. That guy's pretty good. This card man, might be just, OP. You always gotta eat your bread, man. What does that mean? Removal. Eat your bread. Oh, isn't this removal though? Like just bounce your dude and play and get a three no. two. No. <laughs> what is this? Return an online permanent to its owner's hand. Okay, if you have the city's blessing, you may put that permanent. On top. Oh, that's actually pretty good for two mana. Is it this guy? Is it Water Knot number two? I'll just take Water Knot. You don't like 3-3 three, three for two? You don't like... Uh... Yeah, but you gotta have weight on tap. I guess that's true. I guess it could be double Water Knot. Water Knot's great because it taps the dude for you. That's all I want. That's all I want. How many, how many Legion Conquistadors do you think we can get? At least one. That's good. That's a good guess. I'm uh, a dead man's chest dude. Uh oh, it's the it's Enchan enchanted dude they have. If it dies, uh, you can uh, you exile cards equal to its power. I'm just gonna read it, I guess. And so if if it's a five power guy, you exile five cards and you can cast those cards hmm. as though they were in your hand. That's interesting. Pretty sure it's either conquistador and try to go that route, or search for the golden city or secrets of the golden city rather. I think a conquistador is good here. Also, I hope that dryer's done, because that thing's real loud. Whenever it's dealt damage gain two life... Actually, I don't hate that guy. Another Conquistador, though. The dryer is not done. Can you, can you shut that door a little bit? I can shut it a lot of bit. Yeah, you can actually shut it the whole way, because we don't need to keep the... It's cold, so... You don't need to make it warm in here. Siren Reaver, also very good, but... Sorry, guys. If the uh, yeah, that's much better. Yeah, it's gonna be better. If the dryer or the washing machine was too loud for you guys, here. I think we just go with Conquistador here because it's. I do like the life gain from this guy because we're probably gonna be like a blue white control deck with this idiot. But I do like guaranteeing a second Legion Conquistador. I think I'm just gonna go Conquistador. Oh, release to the wind. Yeah, I'll take the Martyr. Maybe we're just blue-white vampires, if that's a thing. It's not. Is it, it is not. I like this, because we can protect our own Azor and then just replay it. I do think I want a 2-drop, though. Eh, 2-5. Gets Vigilance if you got another Dinosaur. Nothing else is... Nothing's great here. This pack's kind of poop. Just take like the river. Oh, oh are you gonna say river the the river yeah, the river, river dasher? Ooh, another conquest. Yeah, that guy's just fine. A three drop might have been better, but that was that is a three drop. The other one. The flyer. Yeah. Yeah, I don't hate that flyer, but now I feel like we don't have to pick up any more of these guys. I think three is enough. Three's company two. Come and knock on our door. Oh, another Martyr Dusk. All right, I'm in. 
Oh wow, we're getting all the dudes. You guys a little better now. Yeah, especially with the these guys make well because you, you make so many one one lifelink zombies that or uh, vampires that it's like. What up, Alan? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. That's is that how it sounds? It's about right. Whenever I get a card like this in limited, I just want to find ways to like make multiples of it. Like I want to, I want to return, uh, like a return a creature from the graveyard card. I want to search my library for it. I want to, I just want to build my deck around this card and make sure I can. I want to know. Keep can it. you show me? No one can show you anything. Wow. Yeah. Get wrecked, Mitch. I did. You did. <clears throat> Mike Barbobbly Boo. Burner, burner, burn. Whatever. I'll take a little cutie. What up, little snubhorn? Mike, you look wrecked. Why do you look wrecked? Why? Why why does he look wrecked? I do not understand. Frankly, I do need a haircut, you're right. I realized this like the, a couple days ago actually. I was like, "Oh man, I need a haircut for weeks." Yeah, but you get your haircut every Oh, mm, that mm, is that worth splashing? That might be worth splashing actually. I flink when it dies. You put a one, when a, when another creature dies, put a 1/1 one, one counter on it if like their creature or your creature. And then when this dies, you create x one ones equal to its equal to its power. This is a four mana one one though. Right, but I think yeah, but it, it's a four mana one one with lifelink that even if it dies with no other counters, you still get a one one. So it's like two one ones. And if this Forsaken Sanctuary comes back, that's pretty cool. Eh. I think it's better. There's nothing else in this pack that I actually care about. What about that lizard? This one? Oh, this is. We also had this in our Merfolk deck, and it was uh, just utterly insane. That seems good. Oh my god, oh. are you kidding me? Our deck is insane! And then someone's getting past double strength of the pack, so that's interesting. Wow! Looks like it's Primal Tide. The old Azor Primal Tide deck. That's a good one. That's a solid gentleman. This card's insane. Yeah, card's real good. This card was such a beating against us the other day. We were just like, well, I can't actually deal with that card. It requires target removal. Yeah. So we want a black fixing. What is this? What does this little cutie do? Whenever it's all damage, deals five inch target creature. Oh, so this guy, like, that's actually real problematic. I could see that being annoying. Probably the sky marcher. It is, but like how many God, this is so many three drops. Oh, what are you? Creatures you control plus and plus. Uh, okay, so it's just a just a pump spell. That's not exciting. I was expecting more. Got another sky march. Oh, another martyr. I'll just take the martyr, I guess. Hmm. What the hell does that do? Oh, it's the Diabolic Tutor that's also a wish. So search, a card, search for a card, put it in your hand, or choose a card you own from outside the game. I guess it's just this guy now. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, Divine Verdict. All right. Reasonable. Mm -hmm. I played against the deck with all these same bombs and pre-release wanted to punch the 14-year-old in the face. Oh, there we go. That's a fixing. Yeah, boy. It's yeah, boy. Fixing, whatever whatever that means. Uh, amulet's fine. Cool. Look at all this fixing we got now. A whole two. Well, if we add a swamp, we have three sources of black for one black card, which is... A whole three. I hate you. I try not to, but it's so hard because you're just insufferable. 
Mm, this guy's actually fine. He's a blocker. Whatever. Hmm. We can add a recover to get back either one of these guys. Good lord, this deck looks insane. This is not bad. And this is also not, it doesn't say non-token creature, so like all of these guys are just going to trigger it multiple times. I was actually hoping to get one of these because it's a nice trick for the Famished Paladin. For one mana. Is there anything in here we're not playing? Not yet. Everything looks fine. So far, so good. Still pretty shocked about that. Uh, not the rare we wanted. Not the rare we wanted at all. There's actually nothing good. Uh, this guy's actually fine. Can make a one one. Yeah, three two with the, with a one one. So he's like a he's like a bloodbraid elf basically. Wow. <laughs> Bold claim. Not quite. Why does it always look like Mike has something hot in his mouth? It's very specific. <laughs> I don't know if it's true. Oh, God. I feel like we're just basically blue-white vampires. I'd say we're splashing blue, but all of our blue cards are double blue. All of our good blue cards are double blue, which is kind of funny. I think it's just this guy again. We're just going to go wide with the with the V-Pires. The V-Pires. And I can just take this dude out for now. I'm not thrilled about him. But uh, he, uh... But uh, he, uh... He gives you one guy... Thing. He gives your one guy thing. Oh, you know, he took that guy out. Never mind. <laughs> what else? What other guy was there? What guy does he the give white thing? The creature. The five drop or whatever? Oh, the yeah. bird? Oh, okay. So, yeah. Is this a dinosaur? This is a snake. It ain't oh, even a dinosaur. Not a dinosaur? <laughs> I assumed it was a dinosaur. Right, because why would I you put it? I assumed that was a dinosaur. Did you just assume his species? I did. So, species. This is a dinosaur, which is kind of funny. Just an elder dinosaur. He's old. That's an old ass dinosaur. I don't think it's aerialist because we don't have early guys, so we're not going to be like... I don't think we have a lot of early guys. Well, no, like, I want to turn one drop to play this on turn two. Like, we're not going to have any problems playing two drops this and three drops. Drop format. I want to take run... It is... The Merfolk deck has, like, several one drops. It's got, like, three one drops. I want to take run aground. Actually, this could be good with vampires, especially because it's also fixing for Alendra. Alenda. Oh, Alenda. But it's only good for Alenda, because otherwise you're just it's, just... it's just worse than a Plains. Yeah, I think Running Ground's probably the better pick. What does this do? Search Rally for Basic oh, Land. Good. Yeah. Untap it. Oh, this is actually, this is a good one, I think. Yeah, because of the Maze of Zith, right? Yeah, it just becomes Maze of Zith. That taps for land, mana, and it also does fixing. It does fixing. It does fixing. I think that's good. I think it's great. Three's company too. Why is this song stuck in my head, dude? I have no idea why Three's Company is stuck in my head. Ah, uh, Slash is probably better than Spell Pierce. Especially because this is an aggressive format. I'll probably just play this in the main deck. Your deck looks good. This is awkward because the one the one creatures I want to ramp to are a Sphinx and an Elder Dinosaur. I might want that cleric, actually. It's good I, with the... Yeah, I was thinking that. Paladin. Or Martyr of Dusk, whichever one it is. I know what you're saying. I don't care about any of these cards. I'll take the 1-7 because it's just a big dumb idiot. You're a big dumb idiot. Boy, do I know it. Boy, aren't you ain't kidding. This, this card's actually pretty reasonable. There might be a second one coming around too, which is just ridiculous. <coughs> Eh, I'll take a destroy enchantment. So this is 24 cards gonna make one cut. Otherwise, I think our deck's real good. This is one of the best vampire decks I've ever. I guess we can cut Kite Sail Courser. He's the uh, only block flyer, dude. No, it's the it only he has flying when he's attacking. But like he doesn't actually do anything in our deck. He just he's just a big dumb. He attacks for two. He attack. He protect. Um. Yeah, probably this one. 
I don't think it's main deck though. Why not? Fills bombs. I mean, we have other. Th we have double water knots though. Like we have double water knot and divine verdict, which is probably better. And we have running ground to put on the top, top of the top. Top of the top, top of the top. Does anyone want to help out Sid with how to get Twitch Prime subs? Because I would appreciate it. Also, Sid, if uh, whether you're able to get it working or not, I do appreciate it. Thank you so much, buddy. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I just need help getting it to work because I'm uh, going to sub to some other channel. Thanks for the help, guys. See you later. Bye. I'll get wrecked. All right, we need one cut. Yeah, I guess it is a courser. It might be. Is it moment? No, I kind of like that. I just feel like this guy doesn't do much. Is it just better than this guy, though? Maybe. I mean, do we care about like this is these are this is the same creature except this has two more toughness for for double white. Hmm. Do we cut one of these two? Ha. <laughs> oh, you make a joke, huh? That's a good, that's a good a joke. <sighs> You're killing Conquistador. I like drawing two, though. No, not that great. Yeah, but yeah, that's why drawing two is so much better than just drawing one. I mean, there was a part of me that was like, if I can cut these three, we can add the Judgment and one other card. But I don't actually like that. I think the, I think the Conquistador package is kind of cool. I don't know what... The Big Blue Dino's been awful for you? Weird. It's a 7-7. I mean, seven, seven is a lot. But it's a 7-7. Seven, seven. And whenever your opponent, like, the first time anyone tries to kill it, you draw a card. At least. And then, like, being able to just discard three lands to save it from any removal spell. And the removal spell that they're going to use is already going to draw you a card, so you're basically discarding two. That's crazy. You're crazy. I feel like it's a three drop. I feel like it's this card. I still think it's a Conquistador. You think it's one Conquistador? Mm-hmm. So it's good. All right. Float is good. All right, one, five, ten, uh, probably eight, seven. Still want double blue, double blue, double blue. So, and we also have Evolving Wilds, Traveler's Amulet. So, yeah. All right, let's see how it goes. I don't really want to cut Amulet because uh, I definitely want to hit our colors, and it also leaves us with uh, four black sources. Yeah, deck looks great. O3 incoming. Uh, hey, that's pretty good. I'm a fan. See, now we can get our Swamp Arena. Or not. The problem is the deck needs... Uh, what do you mean, or not what? Yeah, I have to get a Swamp. You can get whatever you want. I mean, our odds of drawing a second blue and a second white are much higher than getting our single swamp, I think. So, you know how you do. Super aggro. That was aggro. Well, now we're not getting a thing. Now we don't have to get a little Plains Arena. I always want to I watch next next turn we're gonna draw a uh, conquistador. <laughs> it's gonna be the saddest day. What a sad day. God, this dude is aggressive. Be aggressive. 
Remember that jam? That I remember your mom's jam. What kind of jam was it? Strawberry. Strawberry jam. Okay. Oh, thank goodness. I was just like, whew. Don't do me like that. Don't do me like that. I knew you were in <laughs> I knew it, dude. Oh, man. Did I? No more cards. Okay, cool. I like that they tell you. They're like, dude, you can stop searching now. Your search is over. This guy looks like Wolverine, right? This is just a Wolverine vampire. No. Okay, well, I tried. Are you just gonna kill this guy? Oh, you're just gonna make a 1 1. Look at this weird goblin pirate merfolk scout in the in the red green deck. I don't know what's going on here. He attack with his creature. <laughs> he attack, he block, he protect. I guess we're just playing these two. That seems good. Do it. Do it. No, no, no blocks, huh? All right. Okay, boss. Oh, and we got the life link here, or the the life gain here. That's pretty good. Time, everything is all right. That's a Stevie Wonder song, except he doesn't say uptight or uptime. He says, um, "What does he say in the song?" I, now all I can hear is uptime. Whatever, man. I don't care about you. I didn't even say anything. Yeah, you will one day. Oh, one day. Yeah. Saw that coming. Real original, buddy. I had to. Real original. It's in my contract. What's your contract say? Did I have to do? Th oh, old Reggie. Old Reggie Reno. I don't. Wow, that was sad. You just killed that guy. Couldn't you wait one turn and just use this guy to kill him? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Well, I guess we get in there with old three three, and if they want to double block, they can. I guess I don't know. I just let him die. I feel like this I so. trick is more relevant for the other things. Yeah, that's fine. Say if we had a third conquista, we have another card. Oh, I told someone, I told uh, people in the chat earlier um that you and i should get like green shirts solid green shirts and we can wear them so that it just looks like we're two floating heads <laughs> seems like a good idea yeah i thought that would be good wow another one that's amazing yeah it gets long sleeve ones oh i like this we might be able to trade here he's gonna shoot and then when he attacks he attack target cre oh i see you're just gonna make our make these guys hate each other that's pretty good yeah, it ain't great. It ain't bad. I guess... Sid Swami, thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the Sultai Brood. You figured it out. Donate now, Green Shirt Fund. <laughs> oh, God. I guess we just take four here. I don't really want to block because sad times. Is this common? Yeah, okay. Is this little cutie a common? Okay, that's cool. So if we draw an island here and then another land, if we draw two lands, really? Is this where you want to be when... Alright. 
We're one step closer to the edge. And I'm about to break. Everything you say to me. <laughs> Everything you say to me. Some Lincoln logs. I mean, it's a two for one, but whatever. All the fight cards are sorceries, so that's good. We're jamming. I want to jam it with you. We're jamming. Oh my god, why can you not just, can you just not have a trick out of your last two cards? Oh, of course not. Oh, land. Nice. Well, we have no cards in hand, so that's sad. For the moment. This is actually ridiculous because you can actually attack with this guy and shoot your Nettle Tooth Raptor to deal five damage to a creature I have. That's pretty good. Welp. Yeah, this is pretty rough. <sighs> if we attack, they just block and kill it. That's pretty terrible. They've pretty much had the perfect draw here, unfortunately. Even even though uh, two of their cards are fanatical firebrands, which I guess are fine. Did it work? How loud is Mike chewing ice on the stream, guys? I can't tell because I'm right next to him, but. I mean, you just alpha, you shoot your own guy, right? Yeah, and we can't really block. Yeah. And we're pretty much dead. Terribly loud. Pretty loud. Yeah, you should probably avoid doing that, because it's probably not ideal. To my signature, though. Uh, No, it's not a signature if no one likes it, though. <laughs> it's not like... Oh, he's just trade here. It's awful. I mean, he's their 4-4, four, four, I guess. Oh, a little cutie. This little dumpling. <laughs> little dumpling. Ugh, crying out loud. Is the rage a may... Uh, I mean, it probably is, but it's opponent's creature, so I don't know why it would matter. I busted my speakers in the windows. Neighbors woke up and cats screamed. That's rough, man. Good lord. Get your life together, Mike. I'll just have to suck on the ice then. Suck on the ice. One more. Your little cuties are going to run aground. Going to five. You're going to five. Bump, bump, bump. Think we're pretty much dead. Oh, that was a good draw. As far as draws go, that was pretty alright. We can block here, block a little cutie. Block a little cutie. Block a little cutie. I guess we could always just top deck a Zor and try to. Gain a million life. Sure. I'm making the blocks like this, huh? Ah. They gonna fight? 
Let's fight. Let's do it. Bring it. Bring your fight to me. No? Yes? No? Yes. Okay. Keep them coming. Azor off the top. I don't know if that even does it for us now, because, like, they have the stupid trailblazer. I guess it does. We double block this guy. Yep, we're definitely blocking here. Because otherwise we die. Azor off the top. Make it a good... I'm making a good game. All right, we still got, we got, we're, we're getting here. We're, we're doing the things. We're doing something. Still can't block a little cutie over here, though. We can double block here. Gain a life, kill it, get a guy. We got to play around their tricks, though. And by that, I mean, we can't play around their tricks. You got to, you got to go with both. You can't just go with this guy or their double block. Alright. There you go. You figured it out. Waiting for, you know, let's go. I, my, my biggest fear is when it's like waiting to pay costs. And I'm like, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Going to one. All right. Nailed it. We had a good game. Oh, come on. That's just rude. I'm pretty sure we don't lose that game if we're able to windmill slam his door next turn and actually double block and... Ugh. Would have loved to have this guy in here. Yeah, I don't think we care about... I think I'm going to take the, the Courser out and add this guy. Okay. All right, well, he's going to put him in the line. Can put him in Legion's Judgment. He's like a bunch of random dinos he's good against. What is? Legion's Judgment. Yeah, that's pretty good. Hey, that's, uh, that's pretty good. Run around, run around, run around. Okay. I'll tell you why. Never look at the next card is right. Oh my god. It's always the next card though. It's always the one card you need is always the next card. It never fails. How do you lose when you draw Sphinx's Relation on a stick? Don't. You don't. That's right. Oh, uh, I didn't actually enjoy Ixalan that much. I don't know how I feel about it. This is my fourth draft, I believe. So, it's hard to say. Feels kind of similar. Uh, I actually think this hand's pretty good. Compass is great here. Get that fixin', boy. Mm -hmm. That's a uh, pretty good. -uh. What up, Esther Charm? Boop. Boop. This paladin is famished. Somebody get this guy a vein. Because vampires. No, just a cheeseburger. Someone get him a raw cheeseburger. Because vampires. There you go. There you go. Oh, that was great. Because now I can play this and play Evolving Wilds. I don't have any way to untap this guy. Which just makes me reluctant to attack with him. Yeah, I don't think you should. Round and round. My old turn two fanatical firebrand, eh? A classic. I will block. They didn't they didn't let me block. Huh. I want to just get swamp here because if we draw another land we can play. Oh, actually Alenda would just straight up die, which is oh, 
and put more in the deck. Just gonna keep hitting land drops if I can. Yeah, the, it's a 1 1 lifelinker versus a deck uh, with at least two fanatical firebrands that we know of. Interesting mono reds here. No other colors, which is good. Gouda, if you will. All right, take it easy. Oh, my bad. Take it easy, champ. <laughs> oh, that's my bad. I guess we'll just get all floaty McGillicuddy out here. What up, Lord Vin? I wish this was two to activate. So if, if you have seven or more lands, we just need two more lands to to flip this into Maze of it. That's pretty busted. Mm -hmm. It's a good card. Yeah, that's real good. I like next time we can get a land and then play one Conquistador. Sure. Cool story. Yep, you got it. I was like, if you're a conquistador, I will cry. I guess we just play double conquists. And then they'll never know we have a third one in hand. <laughs> Could have also just got a land there, but that doesn't do anything. We can just get it next turn. Jesus. <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> I have no idea what I just read, dude. That is the most amazing thing ever. <laughs> oh. Somebody touch my spaghetti! Somebody touch my spaghetti! Round and round. What goes around comes around. I'll tell you why. Please do. Maybe later. Okay. Cool story. Well. A lot of lands. I guess we get another blue because it doesn't really matter at this point. Now we can go get another land. You're right. They have six cards, we have two. The problem is they have no lands and we have, you know, an excess of them. Why do I keep using that ability? I don't have any more. I think there's something wrong with your brain. I think that's why. I mean, that's... Yes. Somebody touch my spaghetti. Flip them. All right. Well, we're not going to play more lands, so. Just going to get in there with this guy now because I don't care. I'm not afraid anymore. This guy's really valuing this 1 1 very high. You're right. I mean, they have no incentive to use it right now, so. Here comes the old 2 2 that. Oh, old, uh, old Titch McCoddle over here. You know Titch McCoddle? No. It's an iDubbbz meme. I really? think, yeah, it's just like his default thing that he calls, uh, he just says it all the time is what happens. I never heard it. There it is. So you got the other dude. Really? Yeah, you have. Don't even, don't even. No, man. Yes, man. No, man. 
Can I get a bomb? That's boring. God, if she was a one-two, like, like I wouldn't even have to... I wouldn't be worried about the stupid idiot over here. She just made the card a two-two. Yeah, I agree with you. Oh! Oh my god. The stat question just blew my mind because that's correct. She actually wouldn't die. Oh yeah. Because this is a part of the cost. Sacrificing is part of the cost. So she would get the counter before the ability resolved. That's actually insane. Oh, please do it. Do it right now. Do it you right. know you want to. No, you didn't. Oh, no. Oh, but they're going to play the dinosaur now. So we, like, waited way too long is the problem. Interesting. You done messed up AA, Ron. Oh, that's great. Oh, this is going to be good. Because now they're going to deal one to everything. This guy's going to die. This guy's going to die. She's going to get two counters. Yours is going to go on first because you're active. Oh, that was a good... This this is working out well. We're having a good time. Is this the official MT... Is that an official MTG Arena account? Because that's pretty cool. What's happening here? Alright, so this guy is going to make bro. She's going to be huge. I'm going to get four bros. Look at all these vamp bros. I got lifelink for days. How many days would you say that you have lifelink for? Yeah, this guy's definitely getting, uh, getting knotted. Everybody, everybody into the red zone. Everybody touch my spaghetti. <laughs> Somebody touch my spaghetti. You know how it goes. You know how it goes when people touch your spaghetti. I'm going to actually Divine Verdict this guy. Yeah, it seems good. Uh, because I don't want that ability to keep triggering and shooting off my things. Uh, I guess we'll untap this dude five individual times. <laughs> He's real untapped. Let's put it. Let's just let's just put it that way. He did. We win this game handily when our opponent can't draw forests. That's pretty good. I don't think anything else is super relevant here. Much untapped. Wow. Wow. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Huh? Boy, oh boy. Tell me on the doll where he touched your spaghetti. <laughs> Ooh. Somebody once touched my spaghetti. The sad thing about that song is it can't go any further than that part. You're just like, well, that's it. I'm sure someone could. I got one bar out of it. I'm sure there could be more done. More done? Yeah. Isn't that where they throw the ring? Isn't that where Frodo threw the ring? And, Maybe you in do. Morden? Maybe I do? Did I did I throw the ring in Morden? Mm -hmm. That sounds really in Morden. <laughs> it's like important, but... You get it, man. Shut up. You know, I don't think I do. This hand looks very good. This dude seems unbeatable. Oh, little cutie. You got that burn spell. Your mother's got a burn spell. Dang. Got him. Frank, go away. Oh, that's real sad. Right in the meatball. <laughs> that's, that's where you get him. Oh, you didn't want to come at me with your little your little dooger? All right, well. I guess we attack here. I'm pretty sure we attack here. If you had a three-mana dude, you just play it, right? That's my guess. I'm real tempted to get a black here so we can just play Alenda next turn. Because that seems good. 
don't know why you wouldn't do that. Are those lime things good? Yeah, I've enjoyed them. You say, I don't know why you wouldn't do that? Mm -hmm. Looks like we can play a 3-drop this turn instead. Putting in my invisible tea. He's untapped so much, he should be upside down. I, I'd rather just conquistador here so we don't have to actually draw any of these idiots. Oh, yeah, that jabroni Lu Luis. Leonard Scott Vargas. I know that guy. Okay. Okay. I guess we're done here. Somebody. I guess. Is this little cutie coming in? Mm -hmm. I'll take two. <laughs> that match was great. Like that was, people bring that match up all the time, and it was like one of the funnest matches I've ever played. Hmm. Well. Well, that's pretty good. So I guess next turn we're getting a... Uh, we're just going to get a Swamp here. God, Raging Regisaur is so friggin' good. Why do they make, like, three uncommon... Like, there's two un uncommon dinosaurs in every set that are just busted. And the first one, it's Charging Monstrosaur and the... Uh, what's the other one? The one that... The, the Sawtooth that just deals one to everything when it comes into play. Yeah, that one's real good. And this one, it's this guy and the 3-3 three, three that makes another 3-3, three, three, like... Come on. I have not thought about getting back on the PT because I just don't care enough. Like, that's that whole thing is exhausting. And my time is just better spent, like, streaming or making YouTube videos because that's more fun for me. And, um, like, it's just such a time sink, time and energy. Cool. Remember that time we were like, hey, there's always two busted dinosaurs in the set, and then he just has both of them? Yeah. And he plays them back to back. Yeah, me too. I remember that too. I guess we have a Zor in hand, so I'm trying not to like be too upset about it, but it's still kind of obnoxious. Especially because we still need one more land, so... Mm. I like just keeping Divine Verdict up here. God, she just dies to this guy. She dies to everything, unfortunately, but she's very good. All right, well, cool. Communion with the dinos. Oh, the old five drop. Okay. It's good to know you have that, so now we can steer clear of some fights. Getting a, getting a planes? No. Okay, so you're just straight two color. Sure. 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 Just send this dude in one time. Not the sharpest tool in the shed. <laughs> Dang it. Got more? Why do you have all this stuff? I mean, they know we have Conquistadors. So, like, by us not playing Conquistador there is kind of a sign. Enrage Muffin, have a good night, buddy. And then we just never got... A six land. Yeah, we're just gonna have to play dudes here.
this will be on YouTube, yes. So if you guys are not following me on the YouTubes, go over to uh, youtube.com slash Frank Lepore and uh, you can check it out and have a good time. Subs appreciated. Yeah, apparently Sphinx's Revelation every turn is pretty good if you could do it. It's, uh, it's not bad. It's, uh, it's not bad. Somebody touch my spaghetti. Getting real tired of this little cutie coming in here and bossing me around. Oh, wow, we're getting aggro. Who doggy? Oh, you're shooting your own little cutie. I see. Man, this is some next level fighting here. Mm-hmm. Let's see if this does anything. I'll trade you. That's a deal. Surprised it doesn't count as combat damage. I mean, it's a fight. Yeah, they're fighting. It's combat. <laughs> Let's clear them off. Let's let's let the chips fall where they may, my friend. And then I can drop a Zor on a, on a pretty clear board. Yeah, that's great. That was a that was just great. Oh, still no, still no Zor is what you're saying to me right now. Just checking, just checking. This guy. <laughs> Oof. I mean, if nothing else, we can just play Alendra next. Al Alenda. I can't. I keep calling it Alendra because there's Glen Alendra in Magic. So you're going to have Alenda and Alendra? What's that about? They're two sisters from another mister. <laughs> Why couldn't they be from the same mister? I don't know. It's just how it is. Um, I'll take five, four here. That's cool. Uh, what, what, wait, what, why did you attack with this when I can just block it? That's weird. What kind of tricks do you have? I only have three cards in hand. Do you have aggressive urge and you just want to trade here? Because that, oh, maybe you did this and then you just wipe my board. That's, that's good. I guess you're going to try to do that anyway. How many times? How many we've? How many turns have we missed not hitting a land? It looks like just one. No, two. It's been no, two. It was two. Yeah, we didn't hit six or seven. This guy again? All right. You got it. Oh, they didn't wipe our board. Oh, did we do it? Did we do it? I think so. I think we just play this immediately, right? Oh, but this guy. Uh-huh. So this guy comes into play, enters the battlefield, deals one to everything, including this. So that would be six, right? Yeah. Oh. Unreal, dude. You just play Alendra? Then she just dies immediately to this. True. If we play it, it dies immediately. It doesn't that doesn't even work. We literally have to wait a turn now. Yeah, we'll just pass here. Like we know one of the cards in their hand, so. Yeah, they do get to wipe our board except for the martyr, but.
Him blocking doesn't do anything, though. What does that do? Oh, because the Divine Verge? Sure. Actually, they probably would have blocked. Really? Why aren't you attacking with this? Because it's a 1-3. Right. What, what is, what's the problem? I guess they're playing around Divine Word. Sure. Alright, that could be good. How do we beat this combo, man? Well, if they don't have any dinosaurs, then they can't actually trigger it, but... Oh, I really just don't want to play this guy. Like, we should, we should keep man up, I guess, because this is pretty un unbelievable. <sighs> Magic is hard, man. Yep, this is actually annoying. <laughs> In case you didn't know. This game looked great. I think if we were two turns earlier with this guy and Sphinx's Revelation twice, like it's pretty unbeatable. Really? Sure. So you have one card, now I'm just going to have to play this guy and hope you just don't have one an, one more dinosaur in your hand or tighten your top deck. Stipulation drafts are pretty bad in non-cube formats because, I mean, it's yeah, just... Hard like, it's hard enough to build a good deck regularly without a stipulation. Like, if you're only going to draft cards like with certain letters in their name or something, like, you're just going to lose. All right, here's hoping you don't have one more dinosaur. You have two cards. If we can get one hit off this guy, I think we're in reasonable shape. Um, Mike doesn't really like playing because he's not that proficient with Magic Online, so it just, like, we just ended up losing to probably like, timing out, I would imagine. There's a higher chance of it. Alright, that's not a dinosaur. Like, you just win most limit dinosaur if you have a dinosaur, right? You don't slow roll that thing. Needletooth Raptor, coming at me. Just hope I block. I won't block. Really? Aggressive. So seven damage? I mean, you can't play any tricks. We know we can't. Right. So 
So we've got a two here. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. I wonder what you're trying to do there. My guess is an instant or sorcery. Right, but I just wonder what it would be. Should we can gain five? Or we can play two dudes, which might be safer. So we go to seven, like we're just dead. Like we just die on board. I think we just have to play two dudes here. All right. Let's see what happens. No, I don't want to look for any more idiots. Sure. You're dead. Yep. Like, I mean, they just have the perfect cards every single time. <laughs> so, cool. Just in case. Yeah. All right. Deck seems great, but unfortunately, you can't beat all the bomb uncommons in this format. <laughs> oh, good times. Good times. Can't can't beat a two two and a one three in this format that kill every creature on board. Yep. Cool. Oh well, I'll keep it because of this guy, but. I actually wonder, like, I put this in because it's good with the vampire that untaps, but I wonder if the first strike one is just better. Might be. First strike's pretty strong. But these are the things we learn in our fourth draft ever. Oh, what a little cutie. Not okay. Oh no. I just saw an ant on my on my mic arm and I had recent problems with ants and now I'm freaking out because it's not okay. I don't see any more. I don't either, but I'm the ones assigned to more though. Yeah, that's what I dislike about ants. I would say just keep your eyes peeled, I guess. All right, well. Hmm. Well, now I'm just going to play this guy because he's a little more aggressive. Yeah, after like a weekend and a half ago, one ant does mean I might have to burn the house down at this point. Sir, can you help me? My house is burning down. Grab a gallon of gasoline. Can you spread it all around? <laughs> was that from something? What was that from? It's from a rapper, Prof. A song called Gasoline. It's really good, actually. The song or the the house? The song. Okay. Okay. 
which is a very weird place for one single ant to be. And now my paranoia is kicking in, boy. It's kicking in, boy. I've been looking. I ain't seen them. This has turned into the keep your eyes peeled for drafts for ants stream. Oh, uh, I have yet to go better than 2-1 in a Rivals draft, so Th about that good. Do I play this guy or do I just hit a land? I guess we can we can do this next turn if we don't hit a land. I like that better. Oof. Rude. That is quite rude. That is rude. Let me get a two drop so I can get a land and play the two drop. Yeah, that's fine. Do it again. One ant. To rule them all. And in the darkness, bind them. Interesting. Gameplay is no better and maybe worse. Hmm. I don't know if I've done enough drafts to make that assessment yet, but that's an interesting one to have. Really? Well, we're definitely killing that guy next turn. I'm just going to get a Lawbringer, or uh, I'm just going to get a, an island with this so that no matter what land we draw, we can play Azor, which is really where I want to be. And I just hope they don't counter it, I guess, because that would be really sad. In before Hornswoggle. In before Hornswoggle is right, dude. That's exactly what I was thinking. I'm like, here we go. Get swoggled on. Yep. You ready? Mm-hmm. I guess we'll... You don't have to play it. Don't I, though? No. You just divine Verticus thing. I guess that's fair. You're a smart guy. Anybody ever tell you that? No. <laughs> no, no one's ever told me that. <laughs> okay, well, that's good. I appreciate your honesty. God, I wish I had enough, I wish I had enough land to, like... To do all the things? Yeah. Ooh, okay. I'm glad you used that now. That's nice. And you're no longer counterspelled. Uh, my rent is 600 yeah, but I split it with roommates, so. Is that really your rent? No, that's just a joke rent I use. Ha-ha. <laughs> Ha-ha. Also, the way that you said that, it made it sound like the rent for all of us was 600 Oh, yeah, I'm not paying. Well, I don't... I don't That'd be really good. My goal is not going to be rent for everyone in my house, because that would be ridiculous. I'm so I'm so generous. Ha-ha! Oh. Hornswoggle down. Hornswoggle down is right. Okay. The old, oh, Azor concede. Good. I didn't even have to show you my Primal Tide. Hey, girl, let me show you my Primal Tide. They'll take you to jail for that. You better okay. be careful. <laughs> you might be right. God, all I'm doing is looking for ants now. It's terrible. This hand is great. Look at that curve.
Hey, man, let me see that curve. No. Why not? I don't deserve it. Oh. <laughs> you haven't earned my curve. It is too, too vigilant. Lame. Oh, my. <laughs> That's a pretty good quote. That's a pretty good quote. Can't, uh, you really got to be safe with what you say, because otherwise it lives in infamy. If you know what I'm saying. Just around the internet. Yeah, well, the internet's a big place, my friend. I never want to attack with this guy unless I have a solid source of lifelink, which is, uh... This is a solid strategy. Not present right now, otherwise it's just, a, it's just like a lightning bolt to your face. What's just around the internet? Is it a song? It's part of a song. What's it, what's it from? Pocahontas. <laughs> I have my doubts. No, it really is. Uh, just around the riverbed. <laughs> so I made it internet. Oh, that's pretty funny then. I had no idea. All these creatures seem mediocre, I'm going to be honest with you. I feel like we're getting horn swoggled here, here, right here. You didn't have it last game. No, I don't mean the actual counter spell. I just wanted to say it like, like this guy's gonna horn swoggle us. Like it's like a like a thing, like an old timey thing, you know. It definitely sounds pretty old timey. Yeah, like you've been horn swoggle. Two horn swoggle. Is horn swoggle an actual word? I'm gonna look it up right now. Oh, Urban Dictionary. Oh, a con, a jip, or cheated. Don't you horn swoggle me, boy. Okay also apparently a professional wrestler yeah but he looks like a dwarf that doesn't make him not a professional wrestler that's fair <laughs> you like that one huh Yeah, I don't know. That doesn't change what I said. <laughs> like, like what I said was totally irrelevant. And you're just like, that. That being so, it's he's still a professional wrestler. Oh my god, dude. Oh wow. <laughs> god, I can't even handle it, dude. Whew. I remember when I used to be able to breathe. Oh, God. Yeah, it wasn't a good joke. It wasn't even really a joke. I was just responding to what you said. <laughs> no, but it's because of the way you said it. Oh, my it God. Make it not a professional wrestler. Boy, you kidding. Thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. It was the way you said it made me feel so stupid. I was just like... <laughs> Yeah, but he looks like a dwarf, and you're like, that may be so, but he's still a professional wrestler. <laughs> like, it, it, irrelevant. Oh my god, dude. I feel like I'm basically dead right now. That's the high point right there. That's the... That's the... The old tip of the top. Oh my god. I think we just peaked. Just around the river bend, the internet. Is that a... Did you just do internet right now? That wasn't a thing before that? No. Okay. Okay. A professional wrestler, Greg, can you dwarf me? <laughs> oh, here's the clip of it. Here's the clip of me just losing it, I bet. Don't you horn swoggle me, boy. Okay. It's also apparently a professional wrestler. 
Yeah, but he looks like a dwarf. That doesn't make him not a professional wrestler. That's fair. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't that changes nothing, just so you know. Why is your mic so low? I could probably just talk louder. Yeah, why don't you yell a little bit more? Uh, oh, that's not how yelling just, works. Just move it closer, probably. Yeah, my only the only issue with that was that I think it's uh, yeah, I guess that's fine. I'll just get you a lavalier mic. You can just put it on your on your lapel. Can we just top deck Azor here so we can just get my this game over with? Was lavalier. Really? Yeah. I thought that was one of the children from uh, of the corn from Lord of the Rings. Old lavalier. I guess we should have tapped differently. I was I was like I'm gonna play two conquistadors, but I guess we could have just played Sky Marcher here. Oh, well, we can't. Right, that's why I said we should have tapped differently. I just didn't care. I just wanted to get all these bodies on the board. No. Play me a song, you're the bar blobbly man. Wow, that's real good. How long is that clip? Just so I know how long I laughed for, man. Like a minute straight, dude? Wow, I feel like I feel like I just died. I wish I had a blocker. God, my throat hurts. I'm all lightheaded now. He's still a professional wrestler. <laughs> like what I said invalidated who he is. You're like, uh, yeah, apparently he's a professional wrestler. And I'm like, yeah, he's, but he's a dwarf. Excuse me, Michael. He's a dwarf, okay? What you said is wrong. I'm just going to throw these conquistadors out there because they're not. You're going you're gonna to hornswoggle? He does have a hornswoggle. Don't they always? Literally the one turn off that we could we could, we could play it last turn would have been fine. Get punished. That's not the worst thing to get hornswoggled. It's better than like Azor or the other guy, I guess, but we don't have those guys, so that was a good trade. That was a two for one. Whatever. It's funny because you want to keep playing lands in case you draw Azor, but you also want to hold lands in case you draw the other guy. So like the two top end rares in our deck want us to do different things with the lands. Oh my god, you have a third Sun Sentinel in your deck? That's too many. I'm getting real annoyed by these idiots. So you're dead. <clears throat> oh, that's alright. We can actually... Let's start, getting, let's start clearing this board up a little bit. So you're going to block, block, I bet. Mm -hmm. Now you're going to get a little dinosaur off the top. <clears throat> I am not cute for the next PT now. Hey, look at that. We got a little swamp arena. Trade? Trade you? Really? Yeah. Deal. Wow. Huh. That was an interesting uh That was an interesting trade. We have so many good draws here. Come on, one time. 
Oh yeah, that's it. I guess you don't play it. I think we play one. Like the thing is, I don't care about blinking the other guy. You know, like I mean, like we're at a point where like they're they're in top deck mode. Like we're not gonna have to protect the other guy to discard the lands. I'd rather just be able to Azor for like the full amount. I mean, we only have three turns to draw it now, though. So. Mm. Oh yeah, hexproof. Yeah, hexproof. It's utter, it's actually really annoying. And the only reason like we're dealing with this right now is because this guy. Seriously, come on. Because we played the stupid idiot in the wrong order. <clears throat> One time. I guess we'll thin. We literally have one draw step left. Our entire deck is pretty reasonable. <sighs> Frank loves Gutshot. Luke, have a good night, buddy. Thanks for stopping by. Always a pleasure. Here we go. Go to one. Oh, one time. Wow. Yeah. It's cool. like four islands in a row or something like that. It's a, not a reasonable amount of lands. Cool. I don't care about this idiot. I'm going to bring in the Spire Winder just because I'd rather have another guy to uh, block the... Three two. This is what I yeah. This is why I hate regular draft formats because you end up you have to play all these lands, and then like you just end up drawing a million lands that don't do anything. It's actually a good curve. Hey man, let me see that curve. Never. I'll show you my primal tide. Tide. <laughs> Boop. No legionnaire. No. No. No legion. No. No conquistador off the top. We'll have six cards. We'll go down to five cards. We'll go down to four cards. We can draw two more. We'll go to six. All right. Cool. Boring. All right, we did it. So this is two less cards in the deck. Oh, the two five actually probably been better than the. Well, does the, the two five always have flying? I bet it does, doesn't it? Yeah. It that would have been better. That would have just straight, straight been better. Yeah, I'm still. This format's still new, so. It's, well, to me anyway. You didn't attack there. No, I don't want to trade here. I'd rather wait till she's on the board, and then we can actually get some value out of it. Like I can't be blocked. Right, but he can block. Oh, sure. Just because he can't be blocked doesn't mean he can't block. All right, cool. Draw a card every turn. It's a good combo. This? Yeah. Yeah. This card's actually pretty good, it seems like. Yeah, of course. <sighs> if it ain't one thing, it's another. Like, it's funny because last game I can actually pinpoint the one mistake that actually cost us. And it was the not being able to get the, to resolve the 2-3 through the the Hornswoggle. Like, we saw all the cards they drew after that point, and none of them were able to deal with the 2-3. So we could have actually just blocked their guy, or they would have dealt no extra 3 damage a turn. So, that's frustrating. Hey, we did it.
Yeah, we're probably going to be Divine Verdicting that stupid Miss Cloak Herald next turn. It's back with a vengeance. What is, yeah, that guy's a real dirt burger. <clears throat> It's a little scary. I guess we verdict here, huh? Huh? Next Probably. turn we can play the Sidewinder. Really? Why are you like this? That's really good. What gave it away? <laughs> seven, seven unblockable damage here. Oh, give me that. Give me that guy. Actually, <clears throat> we gain a million life next turn if we want to. Now it's actually a good draw because now we can play Sidewinder and get the city's blessing right here and kill, still keep it Moment of Triumph. Oh yeah, this is going to be great. <clears throat> it's, a, it's a pretty good turn, huh? Oh, that's not going to do it. Really? Really? Well, maybe we both have tricks. I don't know. I said yes. Okay. <clears throat> Feeling good about our life choices. Oh, dang. I think it's funny that both of our Spire Winders were the exact card that triggered the... Well, I guess 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah. I guess it's going to be because it's the only Ascend card, so... Oh, 100% block your, your 4-3 lifelink hexproof guy. Do it. Oh, no? You just want to do one a turn, huh? Okay. Do it. <clears throat> do it now you know what that's from my dad that's from your dad yeah, my whoa dad, my dad was Arnold Schwarzenegger from Predator is that from Predator I think so hmm that's a cool story bro thanks bro anytime bro so you have to block here and I think I'm actually fine with that you can go block here block here you take four I guess all of that's okay. I really don't care, right? No. I make four one ones and I gain four. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, block here too. You got it. I don't think I have any fancy things to do. He on tops and then he dies. No, I don't want to use your ability. Hey, Mike B is here. Hopefully you sorted out the whole situation with your mom. Why are you hornswoggling guys like 1-2-2? Two, two? 
That's weird to me. Got a swaggle by its hot. Because like you saw Azor already, didn't you? Yeah, because you scooped to it in game one. Right? Yeah. Yeah, that ain't going to do it. No, no, no. So you go block, block. You take one, two, three, four, five, six. That's pretty okay. And we gain four. That's basically a million. It's actually four. Which is basically, I mean, the same thing. <clears throat> oh, what are you going to bounce? Oh, I just replay that. I don't even care. He doesn't even care. And we get to flip into a thing. Come on. I have yet to see another ant, but. Me too. Ants off to you. Doesn't even make any sense. <clears throat> sure it does. I don't think so, man. Ooh, super aggro. This is super aggro. We got another basic because it flips into the... Yeah, the because I want Maze of Ith online. That has nothing to do with the basic. <clears throat> Which is certainly worth it. So let's say you have the plus two, plus two card. You have no cards in hand. What the hell? Is this real? Oh, I see what you're saying. Uh, yeah, but I'd rather have one less card in my deck. We don't, what do we need a 2-2 for right now? 2-2's not doing much for Yeah, I could care less about a 2-2. I don't understand what your what your point is, really. It's a weird attack. Doesn't seem good. If you had cards in hand, I'd be like, oh, maybe you have some kind of trickery, but... Right, another two this turn, but that... I, okay. I mean... I like that you're explaining to me what a 2-2 two -two in play does. Oh, I had never considered having an extra two power on board. I mean... I'm trying to hit... Hooray. Less lands. I'm trying to hit things like this, basically, so... Let's... I'm real time to just take this guy out for another Legion and keep... Legion can keys the door. I like you the third one. Sideboard, so. And maybe we take this out for this guy. Oh yeah, that's way better. Is it? You think so? Yeah, I think so. All right. I mean, it's kind of good with the. Uh... Yeah, the life is good for the other guy, the untapper. But I feel like first strike is just better in most situations. Like sometimes you just want to trade with it, which you want to kill a four four, instead of trade with it. Oh, hand seems good. I always insta draft Sphinx's Revelation on a stick, yes. Blunderbra, thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. Preach. <laughs> Preach is right. Whatever that means. It means that you appreciate it. I don't need your sass. I was just telling you. Oh, do we have the do we have the two three in the main deck? Were we just playing the two three over the two five? That's weird. I guess because it's a three four, but I don't know if that's better. I guess it's just this. Guy. About the same. You're about the same. This guy can attack, though. He attack, he protect. How many Sun Sentinels are we going to see in this draft? So far, oh, five. Oh, girl. Swear to me. No. You know who said that? My dad. Your dad didn't say it. It was Batman. It was Christian Bale, okay? It was my dad. 
Christian Bale's your dad? I have many dads. Wow. <laughs> a girl has no dad. That's from the... Thank you. Okay. I don't need your sass. What's that sass? It was sassy as hell, boy. Was it? Yeah, boy. Let's block and see what happens. I imagine we'll trade. That's what I thought, too, but I was like, that's a weird trade, because I get a guy out of it. So I'm confused. Okay. We ain't got no dinosaurs. Yet. No, we don't actually have any dinosaurs. Yet. We never will. Later. No. But soon. Is he just going to trade all his guys for my guys? Oh, man, of course Batman's real. This is crazy. What's even happening right now? Oh, God. Oh, oh no. <gasps> oh, my God. What a blowout. What an utter blowout. This is why the first strike one is better. Right there. All right, so we're learning stuff. I was going to say U2. I just saw that he said good good luck, have fun. And I was like, oh, I was going to be like U2, but I, now I feel bad after I just two for one them in combat. Sure. Oh, you're right. The blue guy is a dinosaur. Dang it. We do have dinosaurs. Also, the white 2-5 that everyone keeps telling me to put in is also a, a dinosaur. No. Yes. No. No. One more land and we got that Azor, bro. Get ready for that blood-sucking goat. What does that even mean? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, the Chupacabra? Yeah, that dude's... N yeah, that'd be pretty rough. I like that you knew that. That's funny. That's yeah, the only thing that I can refer to as a blood-sucking goat. What about your mother? <laughs> wow. That's rude. I'm gonna tell her you said that. Okay, tell her. I wanna let me o let me overhear on that conversation where you're like, "Hey, mom, Frank said you're a blood sucking goat." Oh, I don't like that very much. Michael, that's mean. He's not very nice. I just don't want to attack my three three and his three one. I feel like that's such bad value. So instead, I'll just bad value. these one ones are just gonna keep going. Trade me. God, this guy's constantly untapping. <laughs> Martyr dusk number three. Oh, EOT something. Sure. That guy wasn't even a threat to you. That'll do, pig. Now we can just attack with everybody. Goat for the throat. Well said. I had a feeling you'd block like this. Are you going to plus two, plus two him again? My god. My god. Oh my god. I'm just going to get you one of these mics. Why? I don't know, because it's then you can actually people can hear you. I think people can hear me just fine. No one can hear you. Everyone can hear me. No one. Somebody touch my spaghetti. Can't believe somebody would touch your spaghetti like that. Let's see if I can figure out why it is not audible. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I can only bear you at least you sometimes. I can hear him fine, but <laughs> my opponent said, "Yikes, he's friendly." I promise. <laughs> oh, everyone just scoops. 
This card is so polarizing. You either concede on the spot or you don't care about it at all. You either have removal or you die. Yeah, you either have a it's combo like, where you can deal seven damage to it in one turn or you can... It's kind of like Consecrated things. Oh, yeah, we didn't... Yeah, this guy's not in our main deck. Like, we didn't bring this guy in because we don't have this guy in there. You say Consecrated what? Sphinx. Sorry, did you say Sphinx? Yeah, you totally did. I don't think we want to bring anything in. What is that? What are you doing? ASMR over there? I'm doing a little whistle. Oh, I don't know. If, I don't think that's how whistles it's a work. Whistle. Okay. The whistle while wassle. We can hear him, but does anyone ever really listen to Mike? Wow. <laughs> he says, "Woof." Yeah, I agree with you. This there are a lot of bombs in this format. I think a lot of them are uncommons as well, so it's really awkward. Speaking of awkward, his hand is awkward. This is less so. Yeah, keep. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Mike eating ice sounds at least ten times as loud as him talking. I could, I could see that. You can't see sounds, dummy. Sure, I can. I have sound vision. That sounds amazing. It's all right. It's not that great, really. It's terrible. I think Mike B is more ice than water, if you know what I mean. Huh? I have no idea. Somebody touch on my spaghetti. Okay? Who did? Who was it, though? I don't know yet. Somebody touch on my spaghetti? I don't know yet. You left up spaghetti. Does it keep playing over and over? No. That's why it's not, like, audioed up. <sighs> oh, my God. This is, like, we're just going to have the same turns. Martyr into Martyr. Conquistador into Conquistador. How many do you get? Two? Because I'm going to get two as well. Yep. All right. Cool. Literally mirror match. They have swamps. I hate you. Just saying. I thought your mom had swamps. She doesn't. <laughs> she doesn't. <laughs> oh, Lord. My uh, marijuana cigarette. Oh, how nice. It's pretty good. Yeah. I could water knot it, but you can see how that doesn't solve the problem. I guess we can water knot this guy, and then you just got a 2-2. Don't get hornswoggled, bro. M me? Yeah. How would I do that? You might. Please. You don't know me. You don't know my swoggle. The swoggle is real. <sighs> what do you know about swoggling? Well, Rich. I don't have a goatee, so they would have a goatee, I would imagine. I just have a beard. Beards and goatees are not the same thing. And they have, like, a beard, but the absence of the goatee. Like, they shave out the goatee. <laughs> it's literally just no hair around this area. Yeah. Yeah, really that's weird. weird. Oh, God. Actually, they I think they just call that sideburns. That's really all that is. Yeah, but no, they call them, like, that would be, like, mutton chops, right? Yeah, sure. Sideburns don't extend to the face. Remember Mr. Sideburns from The Simpsons? No. Oh. I have not really watched The Simpsons. It was Mr. Burns. I was just calling him Mr. Sideburns because that sounded funny, but... Sure it did. Everyone laughed. <laughs> everyone's, everyone's having a great time. I hate you. What if you're the evil twin? You never know. No.
What if you're the evil twin? For who? Your mom. Uh, that doesn't make any sense. What if you and your mom are twins? Do you ever think about that? No, because that's not really how that works. You don't know how twins work. Uh, I do a little bit. <laughs> not enough. I think I do. Come on, we can admit you don't know how twins work enough. <laughs> how do we... <laughs> Is that really that good? That was alright. Okay, well. Somebody touched my spaghetti, so... This is impossible to deal with. I just can't deal with a 2-2 on the board. Come on. Now we're going to draw a Zor here. I'm not going to have the land, so I'm going to have the thematic compass. It wasn't an Azor. You're disgusting. I'm just going to knot this one. Like... Horse Horse Jr., you're ridiculous. Who? <laughs> <laughs> what does the blood sucking go have to do with anything? Well, well, maybe if you got out of the kitchen with onions, you'd know, you dummy. I'll never get out of the kitchen with onions. Why not? Because they're still cooking. Yeah, they take forever. Yeah, it's a real long process. Somebody touching my aunt. Did you see because I was looking? <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, man. I'm so paranoid after the other weekend. I was like... It was like two, three straight days of just ants everywhere. And I was like, this has got to stop. Eventually, we... Because like, we got the place... We get pest control every six months. So, like, there's a residual spray that stays on the baseboards and things. So, they, they were dying. And they were getting the, the poison on them and taking it back to the colony, hopefully. But... And he's just a sole survivor. Well, previous survivor. I'm a survivor. Yeah, that's. I mean, it's it's possible he just came out. It was from the outside, like he just came out from the outside. But can you just attack with this guy? I bet the ants did touch my spaghetti. Oh, you had a trick. How oh, nice. I'm happy for you. I can't beat like a bunch of two two zom two two vampires with the, with the Lord. Yeah, it's pretty good. Well, that's what happens when someone's touching your spaghetti. True. I know. That's why I said it. That's why I spaghetti it. I know. That's why I said it. Why do you like this? Oh, recover. You get back uh, Martyr of Dusk and draw a card. And you get a Blight Keeper. Okie dokie. Give me that Swamperino. Alright, we got a got a maze of it, huh? Ooh, shine, shine, hush, hush, and We're splashing black for a not it's not a Lendra, right? It's what's her name? Yeah, Alenda. No, it. It's Alenda. Oh, Alenda. There's no draw. Yeah. Oh, can't attack or block. So I'm taking three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ooh, dog. Okay. Yeah, man, we get it. You won. Yeah. <laughs> so we can go block here, take two. Yeah. Then die. Yep, that is sad. I'm gonna bring in a big, big beefy buddy. A big beefy buddy. That's my big. Oh, this beefy is a five buddy. drop, not a four drop. Oh, all right. Well, I thought it was a four drop because you guys were comparing it with this. These are two different cards. Like this is a, this is a four drop. This is a five drop. Like it's not the same. These are not interchangeable cards. I don't know. I don't think we need that. I think it's fine like this. Like, just hope they don't draw their lord, I guess, and hope we do draw one of these idiots. Do 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 do. Yeah, this is okay. <laughs> All the dusk. Martyr of dusk for days.
You got one drop? That idiot? That idiot. That was a good draw, because now we can play this. Ever Dawn Champion. Hey, man, you Ever Dawn Champion? No. Dang it. Mono one ones dot deck over here. Hmm. Hmm. We can play this and play one of these guys and then guarantee one of this. Or we can play this and if we hit another land, we can play any one of these. I guess we'll just attack, see what they do. What's up in the Mitchatopia? You know, scrounging, scranging, scrabbles. I don't know any of the. I don't know what any of those words mean that you just said. Are you sure? If someone said this is what I'm doing, and then they said those words, I'd be like, no idea what that even means. Oh, well, you got to get into the now. How do I do that? Join the Mitchatopia group on Facebook. Is that a thing? Yeah. Can you send me an invite? No. Okay, well that's real kind of rude because we're friends, but whatever, man. I don't well, care. I just don't have any extra invites at the moment. Okay. You don't need invites. It's very this. exclusive. Okay. Okay. I gotta earn some. I'll I'll get you next time though. Did you try to earn some by not being such a Mitch? No, the object is to be more Mitch like. It's okay. called Mitchtopia. God. Yeah, this I is ain't why getting I, you any invites. This is, this is why I'm not invited. You don't know anything about our club. All you have to do to be in the know is smoke the Tootie Roll wrapper, you dig? <laughs> <laughs> Can't argue with that. Wow, that was a... It's real aggressive. Yeah, that was real aggressive. Aggressive. Doesn't really seem that good. Yeah, I think you could have done better. I mean, you saw the Azor, right? No, we never played it. No, I played a game one. They scooped immediately. They said, yikes. And I said, he's friendly, I promise. Oh, and that was the end. Who's Mitt H? Is that your friend? <laughs> Mitt H. Mitt H. Not to be confused with Mitch Hot Topic, which it very much looks like when you write it like that. <laughs> you guys ever go to Mitch Hot Topic? I think I like Mitchtopia better than Mitch Otopia. That's just too many syllables that I'm not really in the mood to deal with. They sell trip pants there. <laughs> I'm tempted to just water knot this guy and attack for five so I don't have to deal with like a trick. Then we can still play Martyr. I'm going to do that. I'm not going to give up. I'm not going to give up. That's a survivor by Destiny's Child. Do you know that? You know that song? No. You will. This guy's dead, right? Yeah. 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 Vanquish the weak. That card is made for your mom. So that she could get vanquished. Oh. She's pretty weak. It's good to know. She doesn't have a lot of upper body strength. Well, she is 60, so. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta make excuses for people, man. It's just it's more of a fact. Just let her be old, you know? You don't have to age shamer. Why don't you do that? Wow. Wow. It's, this is so weird. It's a weird game. I don't even know what's happening right now. I mean, they're going to beat down by two one ones, I guess, but... Which one do I play? The 3-2 the or the 2-2? Two, two? Probably the 3-2. God, you're so smart. This is why I keep you around. Here he goes. He's dying. Just really tired. I'm morning. also pretty tired. I don't even know why. I think it's because I woke up at like 10. A.M.? Yeah. That's actually pretty early for me. Our opponent is not doing anything. I didn't wake up much earlier than that. Oh. 
Oof, got him. Guess we'll just get there with these two one ones. They are doing their job right now. Oh my god, another one one. Another one one. Cocoa Butter, I have watched plenty of Trailer Park Boys. Frank is not, because he's a stupid Mitch. Wow, dude. Wow. Got it. Dead. You gonna, you gonna pump this guy? Really? Wow. So you just basically wasted a trick to kill a 1-1. Yeah, hey, to kill your shithawk. <laughs> You're only saying that because you <laughs> just referenced Trailer Park Boys. Maybe. What would our DJ names be if we started a morning radio show? Uh, my name would clearly be DJ Barbablu. I was going to say DJ Mitch, but... Wow. What's that wow? Why is that a wow? Wow. What would my name be? DJ... Wait, they can't be oh. DJ. Oh, now we got a game, boys. Your Windmill name would be slam this. In the booth. No, I don't actually like Lapouche as a name. Like, that kind of. Uh, Ollie created that on, on Freshly Brewed, but it kind of gets on my nerves a little bit. Really? Yeah. It's just a little name. What gets on your nerves about it? I don't know. I figured out your weakness. I will now exploit it forever. Look at this. Look at this 5 5 now. Well, that's pretty good. <laughs> Look at this Bane Slayer and makes five one ones when she dies. DJ My Name of Jeff. That's pretty good. <laughs> and I'll be DJ My Name of Chef. Hey, that's pretty good. Hey, we won. All right. Sweet. Got him. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you guys haven't done so, hit those like and subscribe buttons, and I'll see you next time.